Okay, so I uh, marked uh, where I have a little bit of slack left over in case I have to shorten it someday in the future. <clears throat> but I want you to see these uh, cable cutters, so the nice job they do. So I'm going to uh, put them right about where I want to cut. Now I leave a little slack. And then just snip and you get a beautiful cut. You know, it's got a little bit of oil on it because this is brand new. But you get a nice sharp cut there. So I'm going to prepare this end and then we're going to start um, putting this uh, new end on here. Along with, we're going to shrink wrap <coughs> this so that, or heat shrink it, uh, to really make a great connection down here. Alright, that's what we're going to do now. Okay, here's what we got so far. We stripped this end perfectly in length with that connector, slipped the connector on, pushed it in really good, and we did not forget, which is important, to slide the, uh, the heat shrink on first, although this end is skinny, you could still slide it on, but if you had big ends on these, uh, you'd, you'd say, oh darn, I forgot to put the thing on first, but we did it. Now this is a this is a killer. This weighs like 900 pounds, and um, it's a crimping tool. It's hydraulic. It's only 35 bucks for all the dies and everything. And uh, I can't believe it's so so strong. Uh, again, here's one, but it, it doesn't have the right size die in it for for this thing. So uh, what we're going to do is we got this thing on so that when we squeeze it, this these jaws close up. So we have to get this wire in there so that the jaws can clamp down on it. This is like the jaws of life, I guess. I think I'll turn it upside down so I can see. Oh no, I can't pump the thing. Good. Alright, so I'm going to put it in there. Make sure it's in nice and snug. And then I'm going to pump this thing to make the crimp. And we're going to hope the heck it works. Alright, let's release it and see what happens. Wow, that's a serious crimp right there, folks. Man, I can't pull that off. I'm putting all, everything into it. I can't pull it off. Alright, so we know our crimp gun works. And we got the right size die <coughs> for this operation. So the next thing we're going to do is get the heat gun out and shrink this thing up. And remember, it's got adhesive inside here. These, uh, uh, these, these are the red ones. This is black ones. These are called um, heat shrink tubing sleeve adhesive liner seals. So um, that's what we're going to do next. Get the heat gun out and warm this up for you.